Andre Rublev versus Taylor Fritz. It's the first semi-final for the men's Madrid Open for 2024. And both guys were not expected to get this far. Fritz entered the tournament as the number 12 seed, and we get a buy in the first round. In the second round, he'd take on Dadiri, and after a close first set, would eventually win in straights. 7-6, 6-4. Third round, he'd take on the 18th seed, Baez. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6-2, 6-3. In the fourth round, he'd take on Hercatch, who had already won a clay court title during this European season. And after a close first set, Fritz would win in straights. 7-6, 6-4 to advance to the quarterfinals. In the quarterfinals, Fritz would take on the 21st seed Sarundalo, who had just beaten Zverev in the previous round. And after dropping the second set, Fritz would fight back to win 6-1-3-6-6-3 to advance to the semifinals. Rublev entered the tournament as the number seven seed, and we'll get a bye in the first round. In the second round, he'd take on the qualifier Bagnus. There's no problem getting through in straight. 6-1-6-4. Third round, he'd take on the 27th seed Fakina, and after a very close first set, would win in straights. 7-6-6-4. In the fourth round, he'd take on the 24th seed, Grigspor, who had just taken out Runa in the previous round. And again, no problem for Rublev getting through in straights. 6-2-6-4 to advance to the quarterfinals. In the quarterfinals, Rublev would take on the number two seed and two-time defending champion, Carlos Alcaraz, who'd only ever lost one match in Madrid, and that was to Rafa Nadal. And after dropping the first set, Rublev would fight back to win 4-6-6-3-6-2 to advance to the semifinals. These guys have played eight times before, with Fritz actually leading 5-3 in their head-to-head. -head. They've only played once on the clay courts, and that was actually Actually last year in the semi-finals of Monte Carlo with Rublev getting a win coming back from a set down. So if it's anything like that match, this one's going to be an absolute banger. If Fritz is going to win this one, he needs to serve well like he did against Sarundalo. He's also going to have to try and be more aggressive than Rublev as well. With these fast Madrid courts, they seem to favor guys like Fritz with the big serving and big forehand combos. So he's going to have to use that to really frustrate Rublev. If Rublev's going to win this one, he needs to keep his cool. He did that against Elkras very, very good. Usually he's blowing up, he's throwing rackets, all that kind of stuff. He feels very quiet against Elkris, which was great to see for a change. But if he does lose the first set, he's got to maintain that composure if he's going to get through Fritz. Interesting matchup. Didn't think this would be the match that we got when we got the draw. We thought, you know, Elkris, Zverev, her catcher in the draw. None of those guys are here. But I've got to go with Rublev in this one. I think on Clay, Rublev just gets the win in a three-setter. Fritz does have the head-to-head, -head, which will give him some confidence. But Rublev, with the clay court experience, I think he gets a win. But let me know down in the comments below who's going to make the final.